Hi my friends, this is Gloria. I haven't seen you guys in a while. I've been a little busy like a spider making stuff and everything. So I'm here to share with you a couple of projects I've been making. I started making them before Memorial Day and hopefully they'll be, they're ready already for the 4th of July and I wanted to share with you some different ideas that I had uh, and also uh, inspiration that I got from Pinterest. One of them is inspiration from Pinterest, somebody had done it, so I tried to make it with the same items in a different style, whatever I could make, as whatever I had in here, my stash. So anyway, I don't know if I'm gonna have time to share with you a couple small uh, hauls that are uh, little things I bought, one from Joanne's, uh, another one from Michael's, and uh, today I just went to Hobby Lobby. My hobby took me, took me there to get a couple of things, and I finally found that young sign that I wanted. They finally had it in stock, so. Even though I made mine, I got that one. The one is, mine is this big, and this one is like this big. <laughs> it looks so big in the picture. Anyway, welcome to everybody who watches my channel. Thank you for your comments and your support and your love. I really appreciate it. I, I'm sorry I haven't been here for a little while, but you know, sometimes things get in the way, but I've been working on little projects. I was trying to finish some challenges that I wanted to participate in and stuff like that. Uh, I mean, everybody else has been holding everything for Tuesday morning. I haven't been there yet since the last time I went that I, I, I showed you guys the punches I got from the first sale. Uh, I've been trying to make it there, but every time I want to make it there, I'm so tired, I don't want to go anywhere. So that's why I haven't been there. But if I get things, I get them. If I don't, I don't. It's not like I don't have enough. I do have enough. I've been collecting a lot of stuff for, since I opened the YouTube. Uh, so that's that. Um, I also have been watching this, uh, something else that I would like to share with you guys. Not today, but maybe in the future. It's a little cream that um, for the people who are starting to age like me, that are getting wrinkles. Uh, I've seen it on Facebook and how they do the transformation of the wrinkles. So I bumped into somebody today at the restaurant when we went to eat. And she gave me a sample for whatever reasons. I said, I must be looking old. So I want to see if I can do a video to see the before and after to see if it really works. So that way it's like person to person kind of people that you already know, like me, you already know me through YouTube. So that was hoping for that. Anyway, I've been babbling away, but um, let me start showing, sharing with you. Let me turn over here because they're on the floor because I have bought this sign from Dollar Tree and I was contemplating what to do with it. And um, though I make a wreath with mesh and stuff like that, I wanted to do something a little different. So what I did was I got this from Dollar Tree, cut it in pieces, and I got this one. So there was a dollar for one string, a dollar for one string. I cut it in certain pieces. And but the way I started, I used one of the Dollar Tree wire uh, wreath form. And I made some flowers with fabric that I had. Let me show it to you closer so you can see the fabric. So I made the roses, so the flowers, and instead of the mesh. And I used that to fill up the circle. Then I took this ribbon, I got it last year from Michael, so I had it in the stash. It's like three inches wide, and it's wired, so I put it around. I glue all this stuff. Everything is glued. I didn't put nothing. Uh, the first thing, let me show you the back. This is what I did in the back to cover it. So that way, Every, the glue had enough and you know you can glue things to it so I ran out I had a piece of this and I ran out of the, this one so I added this one which doesn't look bad they look almost the same this is from Dollar Tree this is from Joanne's but I only have a piece of this it wasn't enough so that's what I did um, anyway I put all the roses rosettes that I made from the match fabric then I've decorated this and everything and um, I did a bow here with a star, which I forgot to put. I was gonna put glitter or uh, winkle tail, and I forgot. And I made it that. And then after I finished doing it, then I attached this to this, and I wanted to do something different. So the bird looks so lonely there, or the hawk, whatever they want to call it. I just I colored this with glitter. All these stars are foam. I colored them and I put one here, one here, here, and here for decorations. Then this is how it came out. Hope you guys like it. So that this is like a 12, yeah, it's like 12 size wreath. So that's that one. Then 
I was looking for inspiration around because I, I, I'm sitting here and say, well, how am I going to do? I don't want to do the same thing over and over. So anyway, I went to Pinterest and I bumped into a read similar to this. This is made with clothes pins. I color all the clothes pins with, you know, with the paint that we get, the craft mat paint that you color anything. And then I had these three stars, the silver, the red, and the blue. I had it from last year's sale. Uh, uh, Michael so I got I had them they were on uh, like a, a, a one I took the one off and I just take them apart and I just did the colors different you know I, I alternated them and then this is oops it's upside down and you can remove these pens too um this is the top <laughs> guys I'm upside down today and so I this is from Dollar Tree I put the star here and then uh, I had gotten the, the little lights from Dollar Tree. This has a thing here to hold, but I don't know why I'm killing myself here. Um, these lights are like the strings that you buy from Dollar Tree. They're like, they're not long. They're like three, three uh, I think it's like three feet long, which is not. So I used two, two sets and they do light up. So I put it in the entrance of the house and they light up. Let me see if I can light it up. As you can see, they light up. It looks very pretty when you you have it on. So I'm sorry you can't see it that well, but you can see the red one and the blue. So this is how this one looks like. This is made with pins, and this is how the back looks like. So that's this one. Let me shut them down. I'm in a slow mode today, and then for the door, I have made this one last year. This is the bigger one. This is huge. So this one was from Michaels. I got um, all this stuff last year on sale from Michaels. So I got this. This is a mesh. I tied mine up with uh, the what do you call this? The, the the pipe cleaners. I don't do that like some people do. They just slide it in there. I like everything secured. So I did that. I, this ribbon I attached there I had gotten this little designs they're, they're like picks so you buy the picks and you cut them and then you can glue them once it's done um, this was a white wreath let me show you the back it was a white wreath that I had gotten during Christmas time it was on sale so I buy stuff for sale put it there you know and this bow is like upside down there you go there's the button. So it was a white wreath. You see how I wired it down? Everything is wired to hold. All my, my, all my, uh, I don't, I don't let nothing loose. Because you never know. Wink. I mean, even though that my door has another door that you have to go through. But, and then I had gotten this metal from my, Michael's too. Land that I love. And I put that as a bow decoration there. I put some of these from Michael's. All this stuff I buy during the sales during the Christmas or uh, during the holidays, after the holidays, I buy the things, whatever I can find, I mean the leftovers, whatever, clearance type things, and I put them away, and when I'm making things, I just take them out. This is, um, this is a different ribbon for the bow, so it's made with this one, and this is wired. So, it's a soft bow, I can't think of the name of it right now, the material, um, my brain is like... And I did one, so there's two bowls in one. So this is the last one I did. So I just put them up. I just took them down to show you guys. I hope you like that. Okay, um, I'm nine minutes, so I still have time. Then uh, two days ago, I went to Michael's. And everybody has been holding all the sales and everything. I, I, they were having 20%, 40% plus 20%. But I guess if you are a reward member, they have mailed me uh, a coupon that was 50 and a 25 of uh, clearance and everything. So if you become a reward member with them, I guess once in a while they send you that kind of thing. Because people were having the 20, not the 25. So that's, I took advantage of that. I didn't buy much, but I had to control myself. I think I have plenty of everything here. So that's what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to be good, guys. Uh, let me tell you something. I've been tempted to go to Tuesday morning so much. You guys have no idea. But I'm holding back because I did pretty, you know, I, I have pretty much a, a lot of punches and stuff. Anyway, I bought this. 
um, first thing, the first one that says, uh, the first one that came a while back, and I wanted one. It says Betsy or Bess, something like that. It was pink and black and white. And I liked it, but then um, I think Pink Parisian Girl, her whole, the one she got, she got Celebi, which is the one with the girl in Paris. And when I went to my Michaels here, I only found the one, the pink, white, and black. I said, hmm. I, I put it in my car, but then I keep looking around, and at the end of the rack, they had all of them. So I was trying to decide between this one or the Parish or the C uh, B one, but I fell in love with the colors of this one. So this is the one I chose. I was playing with the the pens yesterday. This is how it looks inside. You've seen this before. Also, uh, what's the name of her? Ramona from Treasures. Oh my God, Ramona, forgive me. I forget the name. I just I remember your name. Something Treasures. Anyway, she knows who she is. Hello, Ramona. <laughs> She had hold this back way back when they first started coming with the planners and everything else, but she had the one which by the way she gave up she did a get big giveaway with it. I hope she's feeling better, Ramona. I pray for you every day, every night, hoping that you get better soon. I know you're being a little sicky. So anyway, I was playing with them. They're so nice to write guys. And they're basically like gel pens. But the good thing about this is that the colors are amazing, guys. They write exactly what you see here. Beautiful. The red is gorgeous. The pink. The, this is like a, a fluff, uh, fluorescent yellow. Like could be used like a highlighter for to underline stuff. I mean the color. I was. I mean you sometimes I put things in here. You might not know what you get. But the good thing about this is that you can put more over here, and you can put more over here. So if you're on the go, you can put. You want to put any other stuff like any other pencils or markers or whatever that fit in here you can put them like divided in markers the pens or uh, I guess the Winkostella or the water brushes or whatever you can put them here so I mean they're they're the same size so I got this it was $29.99 it was 40% off so it came out to $17.99 and then the guy gave me 50% uh, of the 1799, so came out to what? It was it's about 18, it will be 9. And then he gave me the 25. So basically, I, I, I think I paid close, what? Maybe $9? $9? Is that for a $30 thing? So it's pretty nice. The material is really nice. So I'm in love with the bicycle. And he says, let's take a this. Said, enjoy the ride. That's what it says. So I figured I'd share that with you guys. Then I went to the wash, it enchanted and all that stuff. I said, you know what? I have so many washes I haven't used. And I was so tempted to buy them. I put them in the car and then I ended up putting them back because it's too much, guys. Sometimes we just go by the flow and you no. Know. Anyway, I went to the dollar fifty bin and I saw pretty and floss, flawless, I think it is. She did little tag cards with this, and I'm in love with the tag cards she did beautiful go and check her channel uh, guys i don't know how to link yet i so i want to see if i can learn how to make videos on my camera and stuff like that but anyway i got three of this did i get three of this let me see well no i got two of these so it was three dollars of course you get the 25 percent off i got these three colors on the flowers i got one of this, I couldn't leave it. I had to take something from the enchanted one or the mermaid this, or unicorn, whatever you want to call it. It's so cute. I got this one in yellow. So I got blue, yellow, orange, and white, the flowers. Then this one was buy one and get one half off plus the 25%. So they were $12.99. So I got I guess both of them for $12.99, minus the 25% off. So that was like uh, maybe $2, $3. So I figured they came out like $10 for both of them, so $5 for these stamps. And look how cute they are, guys. Oops, sorry for the glare. Oh, she is adorable. Look at the cards that you can make with it. And the, with the fairy dies that I have, that I bought from eBay. Look at this one. Isn't that adorable? The camping. 
and it says here life is like a road trip enjoy each day and don't carry too much baggage let us more and let's go glamping that's what it says here so i got this too i fell in love with this this is from swap some stamp geez, stamp heinous. that's what it's called it's called pink you lie and it says clear stamp so that's what it is but they i think it was it's, they're so adorable then I went by the tin hole because I've been looking for the tin hole bo uh, bo spray bottle with the water stuff. But I want I don't want the clear one. I want the one that had the black neck, or head, whatever. And the last thing I got was these, this, this ephemeris from tin holes. I divided them yesterday, guys. <laughs> Look what I did. I clipped them because they're but they're so adorable. I don't know if you remember how I'm holding the other things, but I got this one smaller size these are the flowers look at how pretty oops these are the birds they're very pretty this one says boot shoes rubber that's the one compliments so look how adorable the birds this one the other ones are flowers so Anyway, <laughs> this one is very pretty. I'm just showing you a few because I'm in 60 minutes, guys, in running. So I got the ones with the birds. Got the birds, little birds, and big birds. And it has these little flowers. It has three of those different sizes. Got these. Look at the violets, how pretty. The pansies. Yeah, the... So I look at all the butterflies, guys. Let me take this down so you guys can see. There's almost the different butterflies, different size. This one's, you got. I'll take it apart because then they're gonna all fall off. Look at this one. Beautiful. That one there, okay. And then this one, this package here, are the medium to large flowers. Look how pretty. I love this big one with the birds in the back. Same one, smaller. Pretty. Look at this one they're already cut for you guys and you're wondering why when am i going to be showing you any cards that i may haven't made any yet guys i get so busy doing some other stuff that i don't do anything one day i'll show you guys you know i'm a slow like a snail right angie i'm like a snail <laughs> and karen oh <laughs> uh, lee i'm that like the snail girls i miss you girls it's a bigger version of the flowers Look at this, how pretty. And let me show you like this because I'm running out of time. Look at this one. Oh my God. So, so all these are flowers that I got. Well, guys, that's the last thing. Um, I'm going to come back with the Joanne's and the Hobby Lobby um, shop. Again, it wasn't small, big, it's small. So anyway, thank you for watching. God bless you to all of you. Uh, I miss you guys. I hope... To see you soon i'm trying to take it easy try to use what i have in my craft room so i don't spend so much money <laughs> so that is that guys take care god bless bye bye